Hi, Holly here from Tugger. Today I'm going to show you how to produce reports in HubSpot where you have custom properties. We're using the Tugger connector in order to get the data into Power BI and you can see our video on connecting HubSpot to Power BI in the link below. So firstly, open up Power Query Editor by clicking on Transform Data. In Power Query, select a Deal Properties table from the left menu. We will select Deal ID, Label and Value columns. Then from the top menu, select Remove Columns. We can only see the required columns now. Click on the drop down icon from the top right corner of the column and select Remove Empty. We also want to filter the properties we would like to see or keep, so let's click the drop down icon for the Label column. Unselect all from the list and select the required properties only. Now our label column is filtered to show amount in company currency only. The next step is to pivot this column. To do this, select transform from the top menu and click pivot column. Make sure label column is selected from the table. On the pop-up window, select value column from the drop down then click Advanced Options and select Don't Aggregate from the second drop-down. Now we have to select the right type for this column, which is Decimal Number. Next we want to merge this table to the Actual Deals table, so we need to use our new property. Select HubSpot Deal from the left, select Home from the top menu and click Merge Queries. On the pop-up window, select ID for HubSpot Deal, select HubSpot Deal Property from the drop-down and select Deal ID and click OK. Now we have merged these two tables. We now need to expand Deal Properties and select the required columns. At this point, we don't need Properties table in the report, so we can stop loading it in there to do this, let's just right click on HubSpot Deal Property from the left and untick Enable Load. We are finished in Power Query, so let's click Close and Apply to close it and apply all these changes. Let's use our new column. Select Add a Bar Chart. Then select Deal Name and amount in the company currency. Fields from HubSpot Deal in the Fields pane. And that's it. I hope this video helps. Please like and subscribe. Any questions, drop them in the comments and the Tugger team will get back to you. See you soon.